What if it were as easy as one button and toggling to see all of the secrets in the room? Well, this does exist, and it tells you where all of the secrets that you're going to need to find are. And it's a mod called Dungeons Room Mod, it does not seem to be bannable, at least by the general interpretation of Hypixel's rules, and is fantastic at helping you find and learn the secrets. It's got an awesome practice mode that we're going to be talking about later in the video, and it is a is the best secret solver that I've found for Hypixel Skyblock. So let's get in to the video and specifically how you can install this fantastic mod. Then we're going to get into some of the features, so stick around for that. So to install Dungeons Room Mod, first type in Dungeons Room Mod and then press enter. Then press on this GitHub link from Quantizer. Uh, Dungeons Rooms mod, then press on this releases button and download the latest release. It'll be marked with this green latest tag. See, the latest one is from September 12th, 2021. Then press Dungeons underscore Rooms dash 3.2.4 and press download on it. Then you should have to download the file. It shouldn't be that hard depending on your browser and boom, now you've downloaded. So your next step is pretty simple. Do Windows key plus R percent app data percent slash dot Minecraft then press OK. Then in that you're going to want to scroll all the way down until you see mods. So that's right there for me. Then I'm going to drag from my downloads folder. Then I'm going to drag from my downloads folder into my 1.8.9 mods folder or just straight into the mods folder the mod that I'm going to use which is dungeons underscore rooms mod 3.2.4. Now what we have to do is launch the Minecraft launcher and then launch your Forge installation. And now that you're in Minecraft, you should be able to use all of its hotkeys like P should open this menu of configuration. So this shows you all of the waypoints that you're going to want to do. So let's hop into a low level dungeon to test this out for you guys. Okay, so now you can see we've entered it and you'll see a lot of stuff starts appearing on our screen. And this is where you get to the pretty cool parts of finding all of these secrets. So this is a room, it tells us exactly which room we're in, so it's 1 by 2 Grass Ruin 3, and it tells us where all the stuff is. So we can see this lever is highlighted, so we can press on this, and that's 3 Lever 1. And it will tell us that now we've checked it. And it will also highlight everything else. So this one is not like the previous mod that I've showcased, in which case it shows you exactly where you have to go, but instead, like, how do I get down there? Well, you actually do still need to do a little bit of work. But as you can see, it seems like this area was opened due to the lever that I was able to flick. And now I should just be able to go down here and finish the secret. You can see this is three entrance two and then lever two, so we'll flip this as well, and that opens this area, where I have to do a little bit of parkour and go over to this chest. And boom, now we've completed the secret. So as you can see, it's not quite as easy as the other mod, but it's definitely easier to use, because it just shows where everything is, and you don't actually have to go through the process of selecting each individual secret, which can be a huge bonus for a lot of people. Oh, there we go. Okay. As you can see, you can toggle on specific things. As you can see, this waypoint for secret three got turned off because I've already found that secret. So why would it keep showing them to me? But as you can see, you can turn it off if you want. Oh, I'm being crushed. Or you can keep it on. It's just up to preference, um, but you can turn it back on and off just in case it missed it. It also, you can have it show Super Boom and Fairy Souls. As you can see, it's showing me that I have to use Super Boom TNT right over here. Um, for probably one of the secrets. Yeah, that's Wither uh, Essence. And as you can see, now if we press P again, it's turned number one off. So it, you don't have to check each one individually, but it will turn them off automatically for you, which is pretty nice. So what would I recommend this for? I would not recommend this as a long-term solution. You still want to learn these secrets, but for someone that wants to play dungeons more casually, or just wants to learn the secrets way easier, this can be really helpful because it shows you where the secrets are. But if you're going for the fastest time runs or to get into the best parties, this is definitely not going to be doing that for you because, I mean, as you can see with my gameplay, I'm not making it an into any top parties or even close. It also lacks some features that previous mods that I've showcased on this channel have, like it doesn't have a, a puzzle solver for the three wizards or anything like that. But you can use it for a lot of the secrets, and they seem to be the best at if exactly following Hypixel's interpretation room uh, rule. Um, like, it doesn't seem to be bannable. Um, it seems to be following all of the rules, which is definitely a positive and good thing. 
So it does not seem to be bannable, at least at the current interpretation of Hypixel's rules, and it is a lot easier to use. You could also toggle practice mode, which is good for when you're learning the secrets, and that way just when you press I, you will be able to see this, the waypoints. So you'll see I'm not holding I, and I don't see them. Now that I'm holding I, now I can see them, and now I can teleport up. And this is good for if you really are trying to learn the secrets, but want to add this just so that you don't let down your teammates if you forget where one of them is. And that's probably how I'll mostly be using this, because just because I want to still learn the secrets for myself, but I also don't want to let people down in terms of taking 10 minutes to do the secrets for one room. So that is a really useful mode that I honestly really really like and if you want to fix that you can just do slash room toggle practice again and it's no longer practice mode so if you didn't know this video on what i consider to be the new best secrets waypoint mod please let me know by subscribing to my channel leaving a like and you know just doing everything like that and watch the video recommend it to your friends and if you want to see more videos like this let me know down in the comments because it really helps me out and i'll see you guys in the next video goodbye